It was clearly a moment of shock for Terry Thompson. When the guilty verdict was read, he sat down suddenly in his seat. Also in the courtroom during that dramatic moment, the family of John Hernandez, who believe that they are finally getting justice for the deadly altercation that took his life. Channel 2 reporter Ryan Korsgaard live downtown where the penalty phase of the retrial starts first thing in the morning. Ryan? It will start 9 o'clock in the morning. It's expected to last three days. But first, this verdict. We, the jury, find the defendant, Terry Brian Thompson, guilty of murder. As this was the verdict that the family and friends of John Hernandez had waited for for a year and a half through two trials. Terry Thompson was found guilty of murder for killing Hernandez after a fight outside a Denny's restaurant near Crosby last year. Hernandez's father reacted. I'm satisfied because uh, we know that justice was served and he could not be free after what he did. Thompson had little reaction as the verdict was read. He mouthed, I love you, to someone in the audience. His supporters left the courtroom without saying anything. Thompson was quickly taken into custody, handcuffed, and returned to the county jail. After jurors could not agree during his first trial, the district attorney's office put veterans Sarah Seeley and John Jordan on the case. We will be asking for a lot of time because he took another man's life and we think it was unjustified. Thompson had been free on bond. Now he is a convicted felon facing between five years to life in prison. You start getting up into some of those crooked figures, uh, 20, 30, and 40, it could certainly appear that this could be the functional equivalent of a death sentence. And Brian Weiss also telling me truly anything can come up all the way back to Thompson in high school. We're live downtown. Ryan Korsgaard, KPRC, Channel 2 News.